So we have Princess Tower in Dubai. It's considered the world's tallest residential building, towering to 101 floors. So T of N models the number of tenants living on floor N of the tower. And we need to determine what does this statement mean? So the first step here is to figure out what do these letters actually represent? So let me make a little bit of space and we can write this down. So we have T of N and we have N. Now, T of N models the number of tenants living on floor N of the tower. So it looks like N is representing which floor of the tower we're talking about. So this is the floor number of the tower. And T of N models the number of tenants living on that particular floor. So T of N is the number of tenants on floor N. So if we see something like T of 60, let me write that down. Essentially, we're replacing the N value with 60 here. So this is when N is 60. And when the N value is 60, that just tells us a floor number. So we're on the 60th floor, and T is just the number of tenants on that floor. So this essentially represents the number of tenants on floor 60. So T of 10 would be the number of tenants on floor 10. Since our N value is 10, and N is which floor of the tower we're talking about. So this is the number of tenants on floor 10. And T of 30, this is floor number 30 and the number of tenants on that floor. So what this means is that the number of tenants on floor 60 is bigger than the number of tenants on floor 10 plus the number of tenants on floor 30. So we need to figure out which of these matches up with that. So A, the number of floors with 60 tenants is greater than the number of floors with either 10 or 30 tenants. So this is switching them since 60 is not the number of tenants. The inside does not remember represent the number of tenants, it represents which floor you're on. So this is not correct. Now B talks about the height of floor 60, but this problem and these letters don't represent the height. So we can immediately ignore this because of them talking about the height rather than which floor they're on or the number of tenants. And C, there are more tenants on floor 60. So that's this right here. Then there are tenants on floors 10 and 30 combined. So this is the number of tenants on floor 10 plus the number of tenants on floor 30. And when you add those together, it's still less than the number of tenants on floor 60. So choice C is the one that makes sense here.